What's up, people? This is Tripless, and um, first off, I want to start this video off by saying that um, I actually bought my first home console in um, 24 now, I guess it's, it's 24 years. Um, consoles have been around for a very long time, and I've actually bought my first home console. I bought a ton of handheld consoles, mostly Game Boys, and I bought, I think, two PSPs, which were great. It was a really great experience. It was actually my first shift from Nintendo to another platform. and. What happened was, what I bought was an Xbox 360, but I got it, plugged it in, played it, really excited. You guys will see me put that up. And then, um, I was there playing around with it, and then eventually, tragedy struck. When I was trying to connect to my Xbox, connect to Xbox Live, I realized that um, parental controls were enabled, and I could not turn off the family settings. However, I contacted Microsoft and their online support tech team actually got through to me and they helped me a lot and Actually, it was it was a pretty good experience now if you're one of those Xbox users who have updated your Xbox your Xbox's version 2.0175110 Then you're gonna have this problem where you try to put in the code which you originally used to restart your Xbox Which will not work. So what you can do is you can just contact a Microsoft and Microsoft will actually give you the support that you need to get your Xbox up and running. I'm in Jamaica, this actually worked for me, it was awesome. I didn't actually believe that it would actually give me the support that I actually needed, seeing as I'm so far off and most of these things normally only work in certain regions like Japan, United States and the United Kingdom. But was really cool that I got help. If you guys need help, I suggest that you try this out. 